In the intricate political landscape of Andhra Pradesh, the fierce rivalry between YS Jagan Mohan Reddy and N Chandra Babu Naidu is a saga of ambition, power, and vendetta. Both political heavyweights, the chief minister and the leader of opposition, have been ensnared by corruption charges. Jagan's stint in prison and Naidu's recent arrest, perceived by many as Jagan's vendetta, highlight the intensity of their feud. The 2019 assembly elections were a testament to shifting political sands. Jagan's Yuvajana Shramika Raithu Congress Party secured a commanding 151 of 175 seats, while Naidu's Telugu Desam Party saw its influence diminish. Jagan's audacious visit to Naidu's past in Kuppam, coupled with his vow to unseat Naidu there by 2024, showcases the escalating battle for dominance. However, Naidu remains unyielding. Despite facing allegations and the Jagan led government's attempt to raise his rented riverside abode, he staunchly maintains his innocence. The divergent visions for Amravati further fuel their rivalry. While Naidu dreamt of a singular, modern capital, Jagan proposes a decentralized approach aiming to distribute power across the state. Interestingly, their animosity wasn't always the case. Naidu, in his early political days, was closely associated with Jagan's father, Vice Rajasekhar Reddy. Both were part of the Congress and shared mutual respect. However, as political ambitions grew, they became bitter adversaries. This friend turned foe narrative adds a layer of personal vendetta to their professional rivalry. Their continuous attempts to outdo each other have led to a series of policy reversals, with each leader striving to erase the other's legacy. From renaming schemes to reimagining capitals, their actions often seem driven by a desire to overshadow the other. This intense rivalry, rooted in history and personal animosities, continues to shape the political narrative of Andhra Pradesh.